One of the many treatment options for localized prostate cancer is cryotherapy. It's not often used. There's not a lot of, of, of centers that do cryotherapy, but it is something that we should touch on. Um, cryo means freeze, so it is a freeze-thaw cycle that where needles are placed into the prostate. So here is bladder, prostate. A needle is put into the prostate. There's an ice ball that forms at the tip of the needle. It's either argon gas or nitrogen gas typically um, that freezes and with that freeze-thaw, freeze-thaw, cryotherapy is very effective at killing cancerous tissue. The downside to cryotherapy is there's almost a hundred percent chance that it's going to affect these neurovascular bundles and so the, the rate of, of erectile dysfunction is, is somewhere between 90 to 95 percent. It's very high um, because of the difficulty in controlling that ice ball formation. Yes, there are there is a urethral warmer that's placed and there's a rectal probe that's placed to, to monitor the temperatures of these areas. But still, the erectile dysfunction rate is, is, is still very high. So again, not often done. Probably it's most indicated for what's called salvage treatment or after failed radiation treatment or other failed um, treatments. Um, cryotherapy is often something that is done after these failed treatments to control these cancers. Um, again, it has its own select set of side effects. Um, so if you're interested in cryotherapy, it's important to talk to your doctor that's doing the cryotherapy so that he can address those specific side effects. Um, but again, it's, it's primarily used as salvage treatment after failed radiation. There is some use of this. Some, some are using it as focal therapy. It's not, again, it's not done very often or in many centers. Some are using it as focal therapy um, for treatment of uh, localized prostate cancer lesions. Um, but that's cryotherapy, freeze therapy um, for the prostate for prostate cancer.